What's going on guys? Uh, it's October 22nd. I came out here tonight to the food plot. It's pretty windy. It's kind of calmed down just a little bit right now, so I figured I'd do this quick interview. I had some work to do to this 22 foot ladder stand. It's set up on this food plot, uh, clover and alfalfa. So there's a good chance for me to do a little bit of work to this ladder stand while it was so windy out here. Kind of covered up some of the noise. But um, it's about 5 o'clock now. I got out here about 4.30. Hopefully catch one of these first does coming into estrus. And um, one of these mature bucks that I'm after coming around making its rounds and checking for hot does. So that's the ideal plan. We'll set tight here and hope for the best.
as you can see there that kind of ended abruptly um i knew my battery was getting low on my main camera and there were too many does out in the field to worry about changing out the battery and then uh dang that big 10 point came in and i ended up filming him there for i don't know just two or three minutes but he ended up staying right there for eight to ten minutes i think it was and um i needed him just to take two or three more steps and he was going to be out in the clear and all of a sudden he takes off charging towards uh one of those mature does and uh to bump her to see if she's an estrus yet and um he just he just ran completely out of the field and I couldn't get a shot. He stood behind those branches um, for seven to eight minutes, I think it was. Never did give me a clear shot. Oh man, he's a good buck. Um, I'm gonna be after him again. You can bet on that. So make sure and subscribe, follow along. Follow me on this journey to hopefully finally uh, close the chapter on this uh, 10 point. He was a nine point last year, but, um, yeah, just follow along, subscribe. I'm going to be hunting him hard and, uh, hopefully you guys can ride along for the journey. Happy hunting. Stay safe. See you guys.